Hey guys, so today I'm going to show y'all two separate videos. Um, the first one is going to be how to sublimate on a baby onesie, and the other one is going to be how to sublimate on keychains. Um, we're going to start with the baby onesie. I've got it all laid out right here. I'm going to do two separate ones. <coughs> So the first one we're going to do is going to be this one and all you're going to do is set it up by the heat mat light underneath it. You're going to put your butcher paper, um, I'm just using Reynolds kitchen butcher paper and you're going to put your butcher paper in between the layers on it. You're going to lay it flat. Um, my heat press has already heated up so we're all good there I'm going to line the design up because I've already printed the design and kind of similar to size that what I need but we're gonna line it up right you definitely want these to be centered and I'm just using a very little piece of tape and going to Tape it in place so that it doesn't move while I'm messing with it. And then you're going to take another piece of butcher paper, lay over the whole top of it, and especially with a baby one thing, because they seem like they burn a lot quicker. Um, I am going to make sure that everywhere the heat press is going to touch is going to be covered with the butcher paper. Some stuff that only touched it for a second, you're good, but anything longer than that, it will burn it, so be very careful of that. My heat press, I have set at 400 for 60 seconds. We're just going to go ahead and set this on there, and I want to make sure it's on there good. Um, for shirts and stuff, I will apply a little bit of pressure, but when it comes to baby onesies, I just apply a little bit of pressure as I go to take it off. Um, these onesies I actually got at Hobby Lobby. Um, so if any of the stores are local to you, the Hobby Lobby stores, they actually carry polyester now at my local Hobby Lobby. So maybe they'll have some there for you. Um, this order, I could not order it online and wait on it to come in. So that's why I got this from Hobby Lobby. Um, they typically have a lot of whites and that's the only thing I found in 100% polyester. The 6535 blend, they actually had quite a few colors in it, but they're all adults. Unfortunately, as far as kids, my local one only carries white. So this has got about 10 seconds left and I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like. I'm gonna show y'all how to do one more and then the next video will be the keychain video. So it's got two seconds left. I'm just gonna apply just very little pressure Kind of move it some side to side a little bit. A lot of people say you don't have to do that. I just tried to just to see and it worked out great. So I just continue to do that. So this is our first one and these onesies are getting made for a sweet baby. I have known her family for a very, very long time. Um, both of her great, great grandpas have now passed on. So she unfortunately will not get to meet them. So when they asked me for this, I know that they will absolutely love it. Um, my tape, I tried to stick it over here to get it ready and it decided to stick to everything. Same thing with this one. I grab a different piece of tape because that one is not sticking very good for me. Um, we've got the butcher paper between the layers right here and just put it inside the onesie. <coughs> You're going to line it up. I did 
do not reuse my butcher paper. Someone told me you could. Maybe they did, but um, with the ones that I've tried to, the ink from one design um, will actually carry to another design if it's the one on the inside or anything. So I just personally switch them both out. I put in a really big piece for this one. And same thing on this one. We're doing 400 at 60 seconds. I'm trying to make sure I've got one. Oh, cool. And um, next, I'm going to be showing y'all some keychains. These are what we will be sublimating on. They are um, double sided, and I got them from Amazon, and I'll give y'all more information on that one. But I'm trying to post some videos that maybe people are just starting out or haven't sublimated on the items yet and just needing some help. Because every time I get on social media, I see people asking for help or not knowing how to sublimate on something. So I figure that way, since it's something that I do sublimate on, hopefully it'll help some more people out. We've got about 10 seconds left and then this will be done and I will show y'all the keychain video after this. <coughs> I personally love baby onesies because they are so cute. cute. This one is our second one. And the colors are, I guess I should have showed y'all when they were laying down. The colors are actually very vibrant. It is just, maybe you couldn't see it from that angle. So I'll show you that one. And you can really tell with this one, like the hummingbirds, but they are just so cute. Alrighty, well thank y'all for watching and I will show y'all the keychain video now.